Hey man, what's up y'all? It's old Curly Jack in here, man. Jack. Anyway, that's the story of, the, of P.U. P.U. They called him P.U. He was an abbreviation for Paul Underarms. And he lived up to his name. He was a stinky son of a son of a son of a daughter of a bitch. Who lived with a bitch who had three tits, two in the front and one on her back. But anyway, back to the story. He grew up in a shack with one room and ten kids. An old blanket in the corner separated his room from the others. He took baths in the creek, but they could not afford soap, man. So whatever was in the water is what he smelt like that day. It was fre If it was fresh water, he smelt fresh. If it was dirty water, he smelt dirty. Huh, what? One day I peed in the water. And that's what he smelled like that day. Pure piss. See, he was born without smell glands, so it all smelled the same to him. Anyway, he took a fart test when he was in sixth grade. Yes, a fart test. Kind of like when you get fingerprinted, you know. Anyway, one day a detective was called to the scene of a robbery. He looked for clues, but found none. Till he went to the bathroom of the bank. Yes, the dumbass, the robber, left a gift for the janitor in the bathroom. The detective just so happened to be the one who came in. He was the same one that gave the fart test to the old P.U. He said, hell yeah, damn P.U. Done been here, P.U. Damn, boy, you stink. They arrested him for robbery and when asked how could he be so dumb he said I couldn't smell I just thought it smelled like roses damn this has been old Curly Jenkins and what an idiot